Hi. Hi, honey. How are you doing? I don't know. I'm assuming you saw all of the backlash on the Variety interview. Yeah, I just wanted to see where your head's at right now. I'm like mortified. Yeah, remember when Kim Kardashian had the internet all worked up over sharing her secret to success during an interview with Variety? I have the best advice for women in business. Get your ass up and work. Well, now fans are getting a behind the scenes look at that moment and the backlash that followed on the family's Hulu series, The Kardashians. I mean, maybe I should make a statement and like clarify what I meant before it gets worse. Okay, well, let's sleep on it and decide if you want to respond. I love that the episodes are more a little bit documentary style. And I think that you have a real insight into what the girls are doing. Not only, you know, what you see in the press or whatever, but what's really happening behind the scenes. Let's rewind. Back in March, the KKW Beauty founder joined her sisters Courtney and Chloe, along with their mom Kris Jenner for a candid chat with Variety. It seems like nobody wants to work these days. You That's have to so true. Some people weren't feeling Kim's words of wisdom, pointing out that the Skims founder grew up in Beverly Hills with a lot of privilege. We have different views sometimes. Well, on the latest episode of the Famous Family's reality series, Kim admits the public uproar surprised her. Like I said what I said about people working. Do I believe in that? Yes. I believe that you have to work hard in order to do that. But I was just so blindsided by how angry people got. And when Kim contemplated how to handle the controversy, her mom told her to take a beat. I don't know what to do because I obviously, it's all my fault because, you know. It's not your fault, sweetie. People misunderstood where you were coming from. I mean, maybe I should make a statement and like clarify what I meant before it gets worse. Okay, well, let's sleep on it and decide if you want to respond. Kim eventually addressed the critics on Good Morning America, saying that the now infamous soundbite was taken out of context. A question right before was, after 20 years of being in the business, you're famous for being famous. And I, my whole tone and attitude changed with the previous question that went into that question about what advice would you give to women? But following Kim's GMA appearance, Variety's chief correspondent, Elizabeth Wagmeister, who did the interview with the Kardashians, shot down Kim's claims, tweeting that the question about being famous for being famous actually came after she was asked to give her best business advice, which is exactly how the interview played out on the Kardashians. Get your ass up and work. Success is never easy. So you just, if you put in the work, you will see results. That brings up a good point because I'm sure you are all so sick of hearing this, but you still see commentary, which I think is ridiculous when people say the Kardashians, they're famous for being famous. And now Kim says her message was lost in translation. When I made that statement, it wasn't a blanket statement towards all women, like as if I didn't think women work hard or respect the work that they do because I see it every single day. I hated that that got misunderstood and for that I'm so sorry. While some people may not be here for Kim's business advice, get your ass up and work. Back in 2018, she told ET, you just gotta go for it. I think my smartest business decision has been going for it and not being, like having no fear. And just, even if they failed, and even if it hasn't turned out the way that I wanted to, I've learned so much from it. So my advice would be, go for it. Oh.